beautiful day in Kihei, Maui at the Kihei boat ramp. Blue water, perfect conditions. Great day for some spear fishing. Going over some of the shallower reefs that we pass over. Heading out to my stomping grounds and my hunting grounds. Some of my favorite places in the whole world where I feel most at home. Getting ready here, getting all my gear squared away, getting over the spot, judging the current, judging the wind, judging the tide, checking my surroundings, jumping into the water, loading my aim right with my double flopper. Here we see my Alchemy S model fins, the best spear fishing fins on the market. I've got all my gear dialed into the tee. It's taken a lot of years and a lot of practice. You can see the flex and the streamline and the energy transfer. You can see my Aussie reels, 50 meter reel on the gun, 50 meter reel on my belt, just in case if I need it. Double flopper, Dean Petra shaft. He makes them in California, best shafts in the world, I think. Fighting against positive buoyancy and then getting into my negative buoyancy. You can hear me equalizing here, effortless, relaxed, it's all about flexibility, technique. And we have a variety of species of fish here. Pulling my way across the bottom not to kick my fins or make any noises on the reef that might spook the fish. Scratching the rocks to call the fish in avoiding eye contact, keeping my head low. And we have some bluefin trevally we call omilu in Maui. I'm not really interested in those, or the polanis, which are the blackfish around. I'm interested in the school of yellow spot trevally that are behind. And I select the biggest fish that I can find, make sure I place a perfect headshot on the fish not to destroy any meat. Confidence in my shot, I put the brakes on the fish so it can't hit the reef and tangle itself up, possibly ripping off. Coming up, you can see my wide kicks fighting against the negative buoyancy. Getting up to the surface. And as I'm pulling the fish up with my reel line, I make sure not to get tangled into the line. I pull it off to my side and kick ahead. Pulling the fish up from the depths, making sure there's no sharks or any predatory fish. And here we see my fish dead already before it makes its way to the surface. I like to impose the least amount of suffering on my kills that I can. These yellow spot trevally are some of the best meat in the world. Sashimi grade, nice and oily. Just some of the best meat and the highest grade meat the world has to offer. This is how I live. This is what I eat.